So we're going to play a couple of animations that have been made by um, a girl called Aima, who's doing her arts award with me at the moment. So she's doing her Explore Arts Awards. Um, and she's gone from, she's always been very interested in character development and drawing and making up characters, but also um, being inspired by ones she's seen. So she loves Wallace and Gromit and there's one called Pete the Cat, who she's been inspired by. Um, and she's gone from that to learning animation. So she had to go with storyboarding. Um, she looked online at different ways animators work. And she's ended up making some stop motion animations um, with some characters that she created out of uh, loo roll and cardboard and other bits and bobs. Um, so yeah, I've got one work in progress one and then the other one's a final one that we can play. Um, and maybe I can I can just show you the app after we played them to show you how she made them. Oh, hello there. Hi, hi, hi. I had to meet you. <coughs> Help me. Well, what's that doing here? Oh, no, let's get away now. Psh Yay. The end. Hi guys, it's Adam, and today I'm going to teach you how to record. So, I've been recording for Hazel since May, and I'm going to teach you how to. First, you have to go on Stop Animator. You can find this on App Store, but if you want, if you want to see, there's a link in the description below. And then after you do this, go on iMovie, and you can you iMovie is where is now where you edit videos inside, and you can see all the creators who are creating it thingies and you have to go on sound effects and you have to, you could edit anything and after this you can share this to anyone or and put a hashtag odds and crop and put it to social media and then put, put on hash go on the title hashtag odds and crops with me so that's the end and i hope you enjoyed thank you very much for watching see you all later bye so the, um, she used an app to make the animation um, and I was looking online and there's some that you have to pay for but there's this free one called Stop Animator which looks like that um, and basically it makes the process quite simple so you just get the phone and prepare like the objects or things that you want to animate um, and then you just take photos, lots of different photos, move the thing, take another photo, move the thing, take another photo. And then the app like compiles it all together and turns it into a video for you. Um, so you don't have to go through a really laborious um, process of, of putting them together. The um, app yeah. edits it, kind of does the editing side for you. You just take yeah. the photos in the right order and then it stitches it together. Yeah, exactly. It stitches it together. Yeah. Um, and so automatically they do it. So it's quite quick. So it looks a bit more streamlined, but you do have the option to like slow it down as well. Um, and then I am uh, used another app. So she had an iPad. She was using her mum's iPad, which comes with iMovie on it. Um, and the app for that is quite good. It's quite simple. Um, so you, she she put her animation on there and then added some voiceover and sounds on the top and um, using iMovie and yeah so that and then she exported that and um, so yeah they, those work quite well for for this kind of short animation. Sounds good.